Students in the school district of Lancaster, they are now one week away from going back to school. Time is ticking down, <laughs> yes. right? And this year they're going to be having a new superintendent. And he is here live with us this morning. Dr. Keith Miles, thank you so much for joining us. I understand this is an hour earlier than you typically get up <laughs> for school, huh? Yes. Yes, so we really appreciate you being with us. We want to talk about some of your priorities as we start this new school year, a new superintendent in Lancaster. Sure, so we listened to the community around the superintendent search and some priority areas certainly emerged. Uh, curriculum and instruction, teaching and learning, making sure we're servicing our students appropriately. Um, and that area, also climate and culture, operational effectiveness, um, and finally, um, community engagement. And that's the work that I've been engaged in for the last six weeks, just getting here, really focusing a lot on community engagement and getting to know everyone. And so how could that work in Lancaster? How do you hope that the Lancaster community can get involved in, in helping the students at school? Certainly. Um, we have our back to school nights tomorrow and Thursday. Um, we'll be welcoming back our middle schoolers at six o'clock at all of our middle schools tomorrow. And then our elementary schools and high schools are on Thursday, elementary at 4 p.m. and high school back to school nights are at 6 p.m. on Thursday. So parents can kick off the year strong even before school starts with principals and teachers. And we know parents and even staff members were very outspoken during this process of finding a new superintendent. How has their reaction to you been so far? Everybody has been um, incredibly warm and inviting. Um, they got a lot of energy just going into the new school year. Um, you know, they are welcoming the change, um, welcoming me. Parents are excited. Um, the students that I met at summer camps, you know, they're excited. Um, I've been doing a lot of listening and relationship building. So that's been a good experience for me. Um, and I feel like this is a good fit. And how is the district getting ready for the first day? And I know many districts are still dealing with teacher shortages, bus sure. driver shortages, all those kind of uh, growing pains that we've seen from the pandemic. But how, how is the district at this point? Yeah, we're at about 70, uh, I'm sorry, we're at 97% staffed um, right now across positions, which is a lot better position than we were in this time last year. Um, and so with teacher shortages, um, we still um, are concerned uh, for any classroom that doesn't have a permanent teacher. So we will start the year with some substitutes, but being at 97% is a good place to be. We also have a lot of offers that are out um, waiting on teachers to transition from districts. Um, and so we're, we're in good shape. Okay, well, very good. Yeah. Yeah, Dr. Miles, thanks for coming in and uh, chatting with us a little bit as we're getting ready to go back to school. And thanks we for look forward me. to hearing from you throughout the school year. Certainly, certainly. Yes. Thanks for having all me. All right, Welcome. good luck, and we hope all the students in Susquehanna Valley are having a good uh, time back as well.